Hey guys, it's been a while, so I figured I'd give you an update on the progress we've been making at the base. <laughs> it's been quite a lot. A couple of small projects and a couple of very big The first of which would be right here, which is the world map. Now you can really get a better idea for the space we're working with. The item sorter is right here, the base is right here, and it loops around kind of like this, and we're filling out different little things all along this half circle here. And then there's an out peak that looks into the ocean, and my bridge that leads to all of this that's starting to be developed. And finally, another bridge that goes through the mountain here, and it will start development up in the mountains here. So now let's jump to this half circle. We found a mushroom eye redesigned and relocated the horse stables with the two high designs so that they can't get out of either their stables or the main room if they should get we've collected a few cute desert bunnies um this is obviously still work i implemented two of these very nice etho cow cookers they do also work on sheep he does said in the video that they work for cows but um, they do work for sheep but not for pigs I'll link in the description to his guide on these they're very small very compact um, and they get a great many resources so now we have unlimited stakes and I can stop using fish <laughs> which I I don't know I didn't like it as much it doesn't uh, keep your health or your hunger bar full as long so steak is definitely the way to go and I've started on the zoo in here I have cleared out quite a big room um, all circular and um, all the way down here we're gonna put in glass chambers with all of the passive mobs and some of the hostile mobs maybe maybe all of the hostile mobs just as a goal in here um, that's the very special villager that gives me mending books so we're keeping him nice and safe and we'll put him in here eventually um, so yeah this is a work in progress it's gonna be whites and blues and just hoping for a very clean feeling and then there will be a secret passageway down here. Um, and it's not secret yet, but it, it will be in the final design that leads back to our base up there. Here's where that secret tunnel comes out. And this is inside of our base. This will be a mushroom farm here. And here's the progress my girlfriend has made inside the base. Um, this we need to raise up one more and decorate the floor a little bit. Um, this was one of my designs. It's kind of following um, some of the designs Tango's made in Hermitcraft this season, if you guys have been watching that too. And she finally found her cats since we found the jungle. And now she's really started breeding them up. I'm I'm assuming soon they're going to be everywhere. In the base, lastly over here, I've implemented a slime block elevator to quickly take me up to the top of the mountain. And it pushes me out. I don't know, just maybe some server lag there since I'm recording. Um and there's that mob farm that you haven't been able to see since there have been clouds. And that will eventually turn into a hot air balloon. And then, off in the distance, we have one of my girlfriend's projects. She put in this nice lighthouse. Um, it originally had a revolving redstone lamp design. But this circuit and that, um, with the very large amount of lights that it was lighting up, started lagging our server. So now they're just all permanently on. And I uh, expanded the tree farm and decorated it with a couple of lamps. But 
that section is really starting to uh, get developed and look nice. Yeah, guys, that's uh, pretty much the progress we've had in the last uh, week in our duo world between me and my girlfriend. Um, I found a new really big project for um, getting those sea lanterns. <laughs> I'm going to be clearing out a guardian farm in the next coming uh, little bit here maybe the next week. So stay tuned for that. Subscribe if you want to keep up with the status of our world and see uh, these cool designs we're making. I'm going to be making some tutorials and trying to create new and interesting things for you guys. Thank you and uh, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Have a good day.